Hello, and uh, welcome to the stream. Starting up a couple minutes early. Because I figure the character creation is going to take a good bit of time. Not to mention that I uh, wanted to show off some Easter eggs with the title screen here. A friend of mine and I uh, found something that you could just click on and something would happen and then we just spent the better part of a couple of hours uh, clicking on everything and trying to find every single secret that we could so you've got the uh, leaves doesn't matter what leaf you can just do the same leaf over and over gets the little Junimos to show up. There's the uh, E, specifically the E in Stardew. Tap on it a few times. There's a little alien. The uh, This bottom left corner gets you a little uh, thing that fits very snugly in this R shape right here. Makes a little freeze at the top and the sides. And then I think it's this button on the bottom right of this W? Yeah. It gets you butterflies. And I think that's all the little things to click on. I can't remember anymore at least. So, that's the Easter eggs from the title screen. Let's go ahead and get started on the character creation. Oh good, the music came back. <laughs> I, had the, uh, I had the game open long enough that the music died on the home screen while I was setting up settings and making sure everything in the stream was working right. How's the sound balance? <laughs> oh, no, farm farm. I don't need it. <laughs> Five year farm farm. We get the right hair color first. style it's reasonable okay it is now five o'clock 
the uh, official start time of this stream. I'm gonna give people a minute or two to show up and then I'm gonna explain what this five-year farm thing is about. Interesting. Could go with sixty five. Really like sixty eight. Yeah, let's go with sixty eight at sixty nine. It's alright, but... Uh, I'll do shirts last, okay. Shorts, or pants, or skirt, or dress. Uh, you know what? Pants seems reasonable. Ah, oh, yes. Pick, it, pick an eye color and then pick the glasses that completely cover the eyes. Let's go with the 19 translucent glasses. Yeah. Okay. Sure, it's a, a hard choice. Um, okay. So, the idea behind the five year farm comes from a uh, challenge that was set to me by a friend. Every time that I load up Stardew Valley, I inevitably play a season or maybe a year, and then I'll just restart and start from the beginning of year one spring. And I, I never really made much progress. I would just continually restart. The furthest I've ever made it is fall of year two. Like, late fall of year two, but still just fall of year two. So I've never even gotten to the quote-unquote end of the game normally. But... My, uh, my friend in question is kind enough to offer a prize of several volumes of manga if I can manage to play a single farm of Stardew Valley for five in-game years without just skipping days to get past them. So as long as I play normal reasonable gameplay I'll be able to uh, collect the bounty that has been placed upon this five years I don't think I'm gonna mess with any of the extra settings I like the normal community center stuff. Um, the mine... Uh, mine items are fine. Uh, I will do four corners, though, because I like the organization that having the four sections allows for. Um, oh, and if... Uh, anyone's wondering why I have Aquamarine as my favorite thing. Uh, I've already decided I'm gonna go and uh, get with my usual uh, relationship pick of Abigail. And I like the headcanon that since she eats rocks, I also eat rocks. So... 
my favorite rock, uh, the Aquamarine, makes sense for favorite thing. But I think that's all the settings I need to set. Yes. Okay. All right, Grandpa. And for my very special grandson, I want you to have this sealed envelope. Oh, thank you. No, no. Don't open it yet. Have patience. Now listen close. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. And your bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness. When that happens, my boy, you'll be ready for this gift. Thanks, Grandpa. The double digit years later. <laughs> Joja, join us. Thrive. I, I, I will not be uh, purchasing anything from Joja at any point. I'm going to just get that out of the way. Also, hi, Woody. Oh, it's Mr. Skellybones, my favorite employee. Let us uh, open this drawer. PT. I wonder if that's the grandfather's initials. Dear Ninja, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I'd lost sight of what mattered most in life. Real connections with other people and nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I've enclosed the deed to that place. My pride and joy. Five year farm. It's located in Stardew Valley. On the southern coast, it's the perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my boy. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will you? Will do, Grandpa. Taking the last bus into town before the bus driver crashes into a tree and breaks it. You don't you don't you don't see that bus driver again. Hello. You must be ninja. Good grief. I hadn't even considered that I might be doing voices for all the different characters or trying to. I'm Robin, the local carpenter. Mayor Louie Mayor Louis, Mayor Lewis, 
sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. He's there right now, tidying things up for your arrival. Farm's right over here, if you follow me. This is Five Year Farm. Yep, looks like a farm to me. What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's some good soil underneath that mess. With a little dedication, you'll have it cleared up in no time. And here we are, your new home. Are the new farmer. Welcome, I'm Lewis, the mayor of Pelican Town. You know, everyone's been asking about you. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. Yep. So, you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage. It's a good house. Very rustic. I'm sure I could fix it up. Rustic? That's one way to put it. Crusty might be a little more apt, though. Rude! Nah, that was kind of rude. <laughs> Don't listen to her, Ninja. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied so that you buy one of her house upgrades. <sighs> anyway, you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. Tomorrow you ought to explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. The townspeople would appreciate that. Probably not going to do a whole lot of town exploring tomorrow, but I don't know, maybe if I run out of energy while trying to clear a patch. Oh, I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in this box here. I'll come by during the night to collect it. Well, good luck. All right, save progress, pick up seeds, we've got uh, cultivate and har harvest the parsnips, meet and greet people, tomorrow is going to be sunny I presume, fortune teller says today's great, mildly perturbed, starting off on the right foot. Living off the land, we're back again. Another tip for y'all. Listen up. Chop wood, search for wild forest. Or forage. While waiting on your first harvest. Yeah, okay. First things first. Getting enough wood. To build myself a chest so that I can put stuff down Exactly enough wood. Excellent. Okay, let's craft that. Put it right there.
I doubt I'm gonna get very many mixed seeds with the uh, luck currently. As it is. this tree out of the way. You can't craft a uh, fertilizer right off the bat. Probably should have chested some stuff before walking into town, but that's fine. Hang on. What I will do, though, is reorganize my stuff a little. Yeah, there we go. Got Louie's birthday at the end of the week, and the Egg Festival. With the, the egg festival being where you can buy strawberries. But... Well, hello there. I'm Gus, chef and owner of the Stardrop Saloon. Oh, that's right. I heard someone new was moving on to the, that old farm. It's kind of a shame, really. I always enjoyed exploring those overgrown fields by myself. Hey, it's Mr. Ninja, the new farmer. I'm Pierre, owner of the local general store. If you're looking for seeds, my shop is the place to go. I'll also buy produce from you for a good price. And let's talk to Marnie first. Ah, May Louie told me. You just arrived? I'm Marnie. Alright. Now, um... Get some bean starters. A couple of cauliflower. A couple of potatoes. Caroline in here. She's probably in her little tea garden. Okay. Oh! Hey, Sam. Hey, I'm Sam. Good to meet you. And we've got Pam. Hey, kid. The name's Pam. Alex? Oh, hey. You're the new guy, huh? Cool. Why, hello, and welcome to our little community, dear. Thanks, Evelyn. You can call me Granny if you like. Granny Evelyn. Hmm. It's irritating to have to meet all these new people, huh? 
My name's George, by the way. Now buzz off. All right, George. Um, what do we got? The, the saloon just has this Gus right now. Nobody's gonna be there at 12:30 on the. Oh, hey, Penny. Oh, hello. I'm Penny. Hi, Penny. Um. Ooh. Elliot! Elliot's out of his house! Ah, the new farmer! We've all been expecting, and whose arrival has sparked many a conversation. I am Elliot. I live in the little cabin by the beach. It's a pleasure to meet you. Alright. See ya, Elliot. See ya, Wiggly Worms. I'll be right- I'll be back for you. Just- Inventory's too full of stuff right now. Just be back for the dandelion, too. I just needed to come over here. Just, just to check. Okay, she's not there. Oh, well, I mean, this is not who I was looking for, but... Oh, aren't you that new farmer boy? <laughs> oh, you're that new farmer boy, aren't you? Aren't you that new... <laughs> Singing it backwards. Leia does not appear to be out here, at least not that I see... I'll find her at some point. I'm sure of it. Okay. Um, five. Guess I know my inventory's full. I'm coming up here to put some stuff away. Broken mouse wheel. Um, three. The two cauliflowers in, get the two potatoes in. See if there's some spring onions. Get myself a little bit of energy back. She can't eat. Oh no, you can eat dandelions for energy. Okay. Well, if there's no spring onions down here, then might just do that. Ah, I see some spring onions hiding behind this tree. A spring onion. Ah, there's the patch. Thirty-six. That should at least be enough for me to finish watering. Hat Mouse isn't here yet. 
Oh, right, I need to get the wiggle worms on the beach. Before it gets too much later. Don't have a fishing rod yet. Didn't, uh... Don't think I've ever seen a uh, fish sparkle. <laughs> I'll catch her tomorrow, I guess. Uh... Well. As I was saying, I, I don't think I've seen a fish, uh, fish spot like that, uh, on the first day before. of bread. That's a nice find. right now. Okay. Bedtime. Forging level one. Progress saved. All right, day two. Better luck? Still annoyed. And it's always rain on day three. Then. Advertisement. I keep finding cool stuff, but my backpack is full. Does this sound like you? Well, Pierre's got you covered. Stop by Pierre's general store today and check out our affordable size 24 backpack. See you soon. Hello there. Just got back from a fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for you. Willie. Well, thanks, Willie. I will definitely come down to the beach today because fishing is both my favorite pastime in this game and my usual early game moneymaker. I know farming makes much better money in general, but it's not about being the fastest, it's about having fun. Alright, put the fiber away. Now, uh... Okay. Let's... Do a little clearing. Just right here at the front.
Ah, uh, and now I can actually get the, uh, the seeds for the different kinds of trees. Let's come down here and chop this one. Get the third kind of seed. Okay. Now I have to go talk to Wooly about a fishing rod so that I can start fishing. Yeah, to the beach. Hang on, let me talk to Jody real quick. Oh, you aren't exactly how I imagined, but that's okay, I'm Jody. I can read it on your face. You're going to love it here in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. Alright, that's Emily and Haley both done. I found Elliot when he was outside. Ahoy there, son. Heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet ya. I'm still trying to unwind from a month of a month out on the salty seas. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the art of fishing stay alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shops once in a while. Fishing rod obtained! Bamboo pole. Now I get to fishing level 6. And then buy the iridium rod. Just... Skip the level 2 rod. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now. So come by if you need supplies. Also, buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. <laughs> That's what me old pappy used to say anyway. Just gotta wait for the fish to bite sometimes. Tutorial fish? Here we go. Nope. Oh. Messed up the perfect cast. It's alright. It's just a regular quality herring.
Sardine. Should probably go check the forest. First to get back to my one 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 cast at my usual fishing spot for the ocean. Treasure. Let me fill up on treasure. And then we get the fish. Hopefully it's not any massive amount of different things. Probably got the inventory space. Especially, yeah. Uh, especially if that was a duplicate fish. Oh, just ten bait. Okay. That's fine. Um, ooh, wiggle worms. Book! Lost book in the library's collection. for more bread! Okay. Aha! She's out of her house! Hello! It's nice to meet you! Alright. I feel like I have officially gotten most of the major difficult people. Oh, it's two down the lines down here. Um, the only really hard to get person I can think of left is Sebastian. Worst case scenario, I can get Sebastian on Friday night, though. Um, those are selling... Keep seaweed, keep the bait, keep it clam, uh, and the bread. Okay, let's sell the herring and the sardines. Honestly, I could have gone into the fish shop and sold them immediately and then used that money to turn it around and buy seeds. But I didn't think about it till just now. So, oh well. Um... Let's let's talk to people in town. Is uh Okay, he's not home. So my thought process is he's either up at the playground or over Oh, hi Elliot. Oh, he's literally coming home right now. Oh, a stranger. My name's Vincent. Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. Hey, Jazz. Hi. Uh, I've already talked to Penny once, but I'll talk to her again. Tutoring Vincent and Jazz today. They're a handful, but it's nice to make a difference in someone's life. Let me switch off of the pickaxe so I don't just pickaxe myself to unconsciousness. The great idea can pass through your head when you least expect it. But if your mind is too busy, you might miss it. Hi, Sam. Oh, hi. It's good to see you again. 
Um, okay. I don't have anything to donate yet, so it didn't trigger the cutscene. Um, Clint's place locks up at four. Thanks, I really like this. Yeah, I remember. I remember you. You're like the only person who likes Joe Cola. So, and I just I have to poke my head in here see if Shane's working. Okay. Don't make eye contact. And let me steal their trash. Here's Robin. I think I've already... Have you met everyone in town yet? Sounds exhausting. Yeah, no kidding. And the answer is no, because I haven't met uh, any of your family that isn't you. Hang on, let me talk to Demetrius. Greetings, I'm Demetrius, local scientist and father. Thanks for introducing yourself. Maru's over here. Oh, aren't you the one who just moved in? I'm Maru. I've been looking forward to meeting you. Sebastian's not in his room, which means he's somewhere out here. Over here, yes, here we go. Oh, you just moved in? Right? Cool. Okay, hang on. 23 out of 28. Okay, so I know I haven't talked to Linus up here. I don't know if the... I don't think the wizard counts as one of those 28. Does the wizard count? A stranger. Hello. Don't mind me. I just live out here alone. That's cool. Here. This is a great gift. Thank you. You're welcome, Linus. Anybody who doesn't like Linus doesn't like people. Linus is just a good soul. As opposed to Clint, Pierre, and uh, Demetrius, who are all just not great. Take this I'd like to make a second chest please. Okay. Yeah. Let's take the spring stuff out and put it in here and pink for spring. Yellow for summer, orange for fall, white for winter. Anything else I need to take out? Uh, no, not quite. Okay. I've got enough energy 
go ahead and chop down another tree. get down here to the mining rocks sort of let's go ahead and grab a geode get the geode cutscene out of the way you found a geode local blacksmith can break it who knows what will be inside and then in addition to the geodes down here. Okay, I don't have enough energy to mine it all out, but... Let's... Go ahead and... Okay. Bedtime. You guys in the chat have been awfully quiet. Although, to be fair, this is probably a more relaxed stream. Just hanging out. Tomorrow is going to be sunny. Pyramid! Okay, there we go. Spirits are in good humor today. It's, it's better. Alright, Clint. Good morning! I noticed that you've been breaking some rocks open and finding ore. That's good. If you want to get the most out of the ores you, you find, you'll need a furnace. Just so happens, I had an extra set of blueprints lying around. Here, I want you to have them. Thank you. I learned how to craft a furnace. The furnace allows you to smelt metal bars. Bars can be used for crafting construction and tool upgrades. When you've smelted a few copper bars, consider having me upgrade one of your tools. It can make your work a lot easier. Well, okay, I'm headed home. Take it easy. There we go. A mixed seed. seeds I know it's raining and I could attempt to catch a catfish but I haven't leveled up fishing yet. 
And level zero fishing, catching a catfish, is not fun. It's very much not a fun time. I think that's three parsnips and a potato. Ah, what's on the Pierre board? Two chub. I forget where you catch chub. I want to say it's the river. I don't know. Okay, besides Clint and Shane, who am I missing from introductions? Because I'm at 25 of 28. Hi, I'm Clint. Yeah, there's Clint. Oh, yeah. While I'm here. Process geodes. We've got... Juggalite. Orpiment. And... Rock. What do you have to say for yourself, Gunther? Abysmal. Not a single piece in the entire collection. What's this? You found something? Let me see it. Remarkable. It's very old. I'd love to study this in greater detail, but it is yours. Hmm. I've got a favor to ask you. Would you consider donating any new artifacts or minerals that you find? We could make a groundbreaking discovery together. Oh, and who knows? If you keep donating, I might come across some interesting items to send your way. Think about it, will you? If you decide to donate, just bring the objects to the front desk. You got it, buddy. I would like to donate. I'm gonna just... It's gonna be ugly, but I'm gonna just donate in rows across the way as I find things. Maybe I'll make the museum look nice once I actually have some stuff donated properly. I don't I, I was this close to opening this trash can inches from Penny's face. I'm gonna go inside. Just wanted a quiet moment. That's nice. Let me just not rustle the trash can right next to you. Oh. Oh, archaeology pays well. Compensate you. Occasional goods. Okay. So. That needs. Is that 300 wood or 500 wood? I, I'm here. I might as well check. 300 wood. Okay. So it's not that bad.
look, I gotta, I gotta try. If we encounter a catfish and I fail to catch it, that's on me, but... I've had... That was a catfish, pretty sure. Green algae. Okay, let's just... Hang on. Let me just go into social. Who's at the bottom? Harvey. Okay. And I, I didn't talk to Caroline. I couldn't find her. Right. Harvey, Caroline, Shane. Caroline, are you home? Closed. Oh, they're closed on Wednesdays. Well, no, just, just the way things are. Wednesdays. Let's just do a once over down here. For forgeables. Um, here's the wizard's tower. Radish. If I can get a leak. I'll have all the spring forageables before I even unlock the uh community center. but it's another horseradish. And no spring onions? Hmm. Fair enough. Already got a decent amount of spring onions. Well, while we're here at Marnie's, let's go in and 
see if uh, I'm not C Shane. It is Wednesday. Does Shane work on Wednesday? That's the real question. Already did that trash. Um, oh, Shane, found you. No, I don't have time to chat with you. That was rude. Harvey? It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Harvey, the local doctor. Right, that leaves Caroline. Yep. And she's there's no way she's in the Stardrop Saloon. I don't think I don't think she comes here at any point. But I will get some talking with Abigail. Hey, sorry in advance if I say anything rude. I didn't get much sleep last night. You and me both. What am I going to do today? Nothing like a nice cold Joja Cola on a sopping wet day, huh? Ahoy there! It's nice to see young folk moving in to the valley. It's not very common these days. This morning I accidentally stepped on a bug. Aww. Hey kid, you're too young to be moping around in a place like this. Good evening, can I get you anything? I've heard rumors of rare and powerful magic rings forged long ago by forgotten civilizations. I'm not sure if it's true or just a fairy tale. It's okay. We'll find we'll go and find the one ring right now. With our field snack in hand. There it is! We found a leak. <laughs> While we're here. You can only give uh, someone a gift two times a week. Might as well. Warm rain, pleasant way to get clean. It's a great gift. You're welcome. Still got so much energy, but the the day is running out. Be fair, it doesn't take much uh, to use energy. Should I have tried for more fishing? Probably. Was today still fairly productive? I'd 
say so. Yeah, I know it's getting late. Interestingly, this is the only Wednesday where there aren't reruns of the uh, cooking show. Because the cooking show airs on Sundays and uh, hasn't aired the first episode yet. Alright, what's our living off the land? <laughs> this is for people specifically living in Stardew Valley. Now listen up. Spring onions. Go get them. Good luck? Okay, good humor. I'll take it. And tomorrow is clear and sunny. fill the can. And then I'll actually put my watering can in there. Just to give a little bit more space. Waiting around for 9 a.m. so that I can trigger the uh, cutscene for the uh, thing. I think you can trigger it on day four. You might have to wait till day five for the uh, community center cutscene. It's 9.10. Okay. <laughs> Clearly, you can't do it on the first day after the rain. 
just what I was looking for. All right. Hopefully, Caroline won't be cooped up in a room somewhere where I can't get to her. Caroline, 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 Caroline! Uh, that is the second time! Oh, uh, This is fine. How expensive is your backpack? 2,000? 2,000. Okay. Let's just... Very kind of you. Thanks. <sighs> what? Rice pudding? Don't think I've ever seen that come out of the trash can before. It's a lot of energy and health, though. It is. That's getting stored away for a rainy mine day. Two, three, four, five. Can not what I wanted to click. Okay. to grab myself the spring onions, put away that and that, honestly that, we're gonna go catch ourselves some fish. My favorite spot to fish. Huh, maybe we even got some horseradish. Which is honestly the same. It's just the same as the spring onions. Okay. I can't fish at my favorite spot. It is currently blocked. But. I will fish at the lake.
Still got three inventory spots. I cast further. Yeah, that's what I thought. I've leveled up my fishing. Carp doesn't sell for much, but there's a geode. Let's go for one more cast. Fancy. Large mouth bass. Nice. Well, I won't be selling these for the most part. It's their basic quality. I can use them for the uh, bundle when I unlock the uh, fishing bundles. Just get the lake fish bundle most of the way done right off the bat. Um, and then chub is for the bulletin board. Keep geode on me for minor. I'll sell the silver star bullhead. Give myself a little bit of money. Um, I could continue fishing. And I think I will. Put the geode in here for right now. Hey, buddy. Do you want something from me? No. Just wanted to say hi. Didn't say hi when I passed by the first time. Figured I could say hi passing by the second time. Let's eat the field snack. Move that closer, and then... Now, regular quality chub would be nice to just put in the chest and switch it out for the silver star, but other than that, all the rest of these fish, pure profit. So if I can get a chest out of it, it might have something good in it. I would absolutely love it if I could get the... Uh, the sword before even the mines unlock. I mean, iron ore is pretty good. It's not enough for a bar, but... That's not, yeah, it's bullhead. Bullhead's, bullhead's not bad. Better than carp. Largemouth bass is where the money's at, though. This is another bullhead. 
Yeah. This is a carp. Yeah, it's late enough of the day, maybe I'll catch a bream. Set that aside for the night fishing. Ah, there's that regular quality chub. Aha! Gold star. Still gonna be worth chump change. But for somebody who's currently got 35G, chump change is not the worst. I've got, what, 32 energy left? Didn't even need the rest of the spring onions. Um, let's put just the chub, take that chub out, put those away, and then, yeah, good on the rest. Sell all these fish. Get you for tomorrow. Yeah. Sounds good to me. Yeah, I already checked. It's sunny tomorrow. Fishing plus one. Let's see, 500 G is not bad. 45 for the gold star carp. Uh, but 125 for the silver star largemouth bass. All right, let's get this watering done. But first, let's check the TV weather report. It is partially cloudy, light breeze. Okay. How's the fortunes? Neutral. Okay. I'll take a neutral day. Oh, it's parsnips. To our valued Joja Mart customers, I am not. Our team members have removed the landslide uh, caused by our drilling operations near the mountain lake. Right, so the mines are now open up. Um, I'd like to remind you that our drilling operation is entirely legal <laughs> pursuant to uh, this amendment from Jojico. <laughs> we have... <laughs> I, I assure you, our blockade is entirely legal, said the Trade Federation. Uh, responsible stewardship of the local environment is our top priority. We apologize for any inconvenience this accident may have caused. As always, we value your continued support and patronage. Morris, Joja Customer Satisfaction Representative. Okay. Okay, what do you have to say? Getting started. That's good. No, harvesting, yeah. That harvesting them was enough for me to level up. Build a coop. 
Building a coop is not high on my priorities. Okay, three to use for giving people stuff, um, and or seed maker when I get that, and one to use for the bundle. The rest of these are getting sold to potentially buy more seeds, but first... water plants while we're waiting for time to tick over. Then I'll water these 15 ground spots. Because unless the traveling cart, which is here, unless she's selling something incredible that I can afford, uh, I'm just gonna buy 15 seeds to fill up that spot. Start by coming down here. Seeing what she's got. And how much, ex how expensive it is. Okay. Flowers, eggplant parmesan, straw floor. Um, a radish is neat. I'm I'm kind of tempted by the <laughs> by the cockle because I have had numerous times where I couldn't finish the crab pot bundle without crafting a crab pot for an entire season and a half because this thing wouldn't spawn on the beach. Um, cave carrots. Espresso, wine, uh, okay, rare seed for a thousand is nice, but not anything groundbreaking that I feel the need to spend my money on that instead of uh, potato seeds. Or a bigger bag, honestly. source right here. Okay. It's past nine. Gonna put the watering can away. Oh, hang on. Let me grab that out. Actually, gonna take a second, craft myself another chest. Blue. Fish, 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 fish. Fish and garbage, garbage. Uh, I don't see any other garbage. Let's get the grab the geode. Go ahead and get that cracked open. Okay. There we go. Here's the cutscene. 
Oh, and it's good to know that there's some uh, flowers up there, because I was forgetting to grab those. to, Because I still need to talk to Caroline at some point. Oh, hi there. What an nice whore. This is the Pelican Town Community Center, or what's left of it anyway. Used to be the pride and joy of the town, always bustling with activity. Now just look at it. It's shameful. These days, the young folk would rather sit in front of the TV than engage with the community. But listen to me. It so I sound like an old fool. Joja Corp has uh, been hounding me to sell them the land so they can turn it into a warehouse. Pelican Town could use the money, but there's something stopping me from selling it. I guess old-timers like me get attached to relics of the past. Ah, well. If anyone else buys a Joja Co. membership, I'm just gonna go ahead and sell it. <sighs> Here, let's go inside. Hmm, what's this? I guess Vincent and Jazz must have been playing in here. This place is even more dilapidated than I remember. Hello! What? What's the matter? Are you ill? There was a Junimo, right there, a spirit of the forest. You saw something? <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if this place was full of rats. That's no rat. You're worrying me, ninja. Look. I think I'm going to head home. I need some lunch. Hey, I I'll keep this place unlocked from now on. Maybe you can help catch that rat if you have some extra time. Strange. I'll have to come back and explore this building further. Okay, while I'm literally in front of the door, let's just waltz on in, come down here, read the ancient script, alright, now let's pick up some flowers to give to Pierre and his wife. If Caroline ever stops hiding in her garden. Hang on, what's the... Flounder. Can you... Where... What? Can you even catch a flounder? I, I think that's a spring fish. I... I'm not even... I'm not gonna bother picking that up right now. Okay, it's Friday. Caroline... It's daytime. Abigail's coming out from over here. Wow, I just realized it's Friday. Well, I'd love to be friends with Caroline, but she never is out and about for me to talk to her to introduce myself still haven't finished introductions, and it's Friday! Okay, let's sell the parsnips. 
and then let's just You know what? Let's just spy 20. And then, you know what, Peter? Since you're actually here, it's very kind of you. I like this. Okay, let's just do a quick trip to the geode cracker aka Clint and then double back to see if Caroline has process geode okay that's an earth crystal which has value, but also is a mineral I haven't donated, so it's got extra value right now. Hey Caroline, it's afternoon. You still in your tea garden? <laughs> hey Harvey. This stuff can definitely be incorporated into a healthy diet. Okay. Well, unless she's up here. Okay, Haley's up here. I'm gonna put down my potatoes and I'm gonna go mining. Just some basic mining. Oh, watering can, right. Okay. Now I put the watering can away. And let's... Let's just go back... Past Caroline. Just... Just in case... On the way... To the mine... Before... He closes shop for the day. Yes, hello. Hi. Is your wife hiding in a closet still? She's either up there or she's out and about somewhere in town.
Well, worst comes to worst, uh, I think Tuesday is exercise day, and she's part of the exercise crew. So... That's something. In the meanwhile, it's pretty late in the day, so I'm not gonna bother with food, but... Hmm... I was just peering down to this old mine shaft. It's been abandoned for decades. Still, there's probably good ore down there. But a dark place undisturbed for so long, I'm afraid ore isn't the only thing you find. Here, take this. You might need it. Yay! Rusty Sword. Name's Marlin. By the way, I run the Adventurers Guild right outside. I'll keep an eye on you. Prove yourself, and I might think about making you a member. Okay. Reach level 5. Yeah, I can't craft a scarecrow till tomorrow. boots. Take that. I'll go fight a crab. Come here, crab. Your shell is gone. the way down. And there we have another way down. I see that quartz. How do I get to that quartz? Um, is it down from here? Yes. Okay. down and then go back up. Gunther can tell about the course. Did I <laughs> did I go to to Gunther and or Clint and not crack the geode that I had with me? 
Or did I find another geode while I was down mine? I I found a geode while mining. Okay. Robin has a hot temper. It's better to stay on her good side. Don't tell her I said that. She literally walked through you while you were saying that. You've met my son Sebastian, right? He lives downstairs. We keep him in the basement. Uh, I don't really know you. It's okay, Sebastian. Okay, hang on. Yeah, Louis' birthday's at the end of the week. I've got the place open, but I need to get the thing translated. Gonna drop stuff off. copper ore and 25 stone. I have 25 stone for sure. Literally just all my copper. Make furnace. Stick that there. No. Um... Smelt copper, 40 levels in the mine, craft the scarecrow, get Caroline to come out of her hiding hole. Um, yeah, it's late. I don't need to max use all my energy. Okay. Scarecrow needs uh, coal and forget what else. I've got, I've got three pieces of coal. Mining. Cherry bomb. Uh, how's the fortune? It, yes, let's go straight back to the mines with red skull luck. Beautiful sunny tomorrow. Just to show you the importance of a scarecrow. 50 wood. 20 fiber. One coal. Okay. Ah, uh, yes. My sources tell me that you've been poking around inside the old community center. Why don't you pay me a visit? My chambers are west of the forest lake, in the stone tower. I may have information concerning your rat problem. M. Rasmodius, the wizard. I see you've been exploring the old mine. Yeah, venture spirit. How much I can tell. If you slay ten slimes, you'll have earned a place in my adventurer's guild. Be careful. Marlon. Did the scarecrow. Gotta go meet the wizard. Gotta go kill ten slimes. I've gotta water some crops. Um, there's the watering can.
Get the watering can back up. Okay, I need to take that, get cracked. Alright, that, and go talk to wizards. Check for Caroline's. First, let's... Let's just waltz down here a little bit. I'm one copper short. Wizard cutscene. No, no, let's let's do town. I shouldn't be indecisive like this, but if I do town, I can get a lot of this out of my hot bar. Although I can already just do that. Wait, hang on. And copper. Um. But We've got two things to donate, one thing to crack open and probably donate, depending on what comes out. It's on the board. I'll I'll do that. Kill four four green slimes. generally what my plans were for today to a degree anyway process me geode Just some rocks it's fine definitely not a waste of 25 gold nope Alright, we're gonna donate quartz. We're gonna donate that new reward. What's the reward? Cauliflower seeds! Alright. Didn't hear you. I'm busy thinking about something. One second, gotta beat this level. Okay. Alright, Sam, beat your level. Hi, Haley. I'm feeling an urge to go shopping. Ugh, I wish there was a mall here. Good for you. Good for you, Haley. Caroline! Do you exist? You're not in the kitchen. I don't know where you go around town. I think I've seen you just hanging out down here at one point talking to Jody or something, but... Definitely not seeing that right now. Hi, Shane. Why are you bothering me? I want to be alone. Okay, bye, Shane. All 
All right, Rasmodius, open up. Ah, come in. I am Rasmodius, seeker of the arcane truths, medium mediary between physical and ethereal. Master of the Seven Elements, Keeper of the Sacred Ch- uh, you get the point. And you, Ninja, the one whose arrival I have long foreseen. Here, I'd like to show you something. Behold! That's it. That's the thing. You've seen one before, haven't you? They call themselves the Junimos. Mysterious spirits, these ones. For some reason, they refuse to speak with me. Uh, maybe because you're basically holding it hostage when you just summon it in that circle there? I'm not sure why they've moved into the community center, but you have no reason to fear them. Hmm? You found a golden scroll written in an unknown language. Most interesting! Stay here, I'm going to go see for myself. I'll return shortly. Away! Rasmodius! I didn't feel like teleporting back, so I just walked. I found the note. The language is obscure, but I was able to decipher it. Actually, if there was a key on the back of the paper, but I sound cooler if I just say that it was an obscure language. Uh, we, the Junimos, are happy to aid you. In return, we ask for gifts of the valley. If you are one with the forest, then you will see the true nature of this scroll. Mm, yes, gifts of the valley. Bring us cash, cash money. So says the vault. One with the forest. What do they mean? Aha! Come here. My cauldron is bubbling with ingredients from the forest. Baby fern, moss grab, caramel top toadstool. Can you smell it? Can you smell what the wizard is cooking? Here, drink up. Let the essence of the forest permeate your body. Let me just drink a random potion handed to me by a wizard. Definitely not drugs. This is fine. I have become one, one with nature. You've gained the power of forest magic. Now you can decipher the true meaning of the Genimo scrolls. Thanks, Rasmodius. Oh, hang on. Let me actually go in and chat with you for a second. Hey, Rasmodius. 
Ah, yes, I have predicted your arrival a long time ago, young ninja. Okay. One, uh, magic potion of, uh, forest essence later. Just come here and I'm gonna Oop. three, four, five, six, uh, seven, eight. I'm just gonna go ahead and clear this out. I know it's better to wait until you get a silo so that you can get hay from this stuff, but I just like to have a slightly more clear first square. Have my watering can equipped. Um, there we go. Four. Okay. Now I need to go kill slimes. What else do I need to do? Um, oh, talk to Caroline. Uh, yeah, let's just talk to, see if, let's, okay, oh, I just unlocked the community center, right, I was going to go donate bundle stuff, let's grab one of each, uh, two daffodils in case Caroline exists, um, and I'll grab a parsnip for the... Cave carrot. Um, let's go from. Wait, wait, hang on. I can actually see what's. That's where the cave carrot's going. Summer, fall, construction. I mean, I could bring the wood for construction, or some of the wood at least, but. Can't do. Fish. Also, clams should be in with the fish, as should this bait. Um, okay, let's just check on Caroline on the way to the mine and the community center. the new farmer I'm Caroline hi Caroline oh goodness are you sure yes I'm positive give me my money <sighs> okay so uh, found Caroline we did it I just need to go kill some slimes, donate some stuff, 
plant the, the spring forage seeds that I get from this. Okay. Doesn't have to be in order, but I like it when I can put them in the exact order. Bundle complete! Spring seeds! And let's just go ahead and put the one cave carrot I have in there. Uh, okay, the fish bundle unlocks here too. So I'll figure out what I can do fish wise. The first spring crop parsnip. Okay. I need to plant these seeds and kill slimes in the mine between today and tomorrow. All the watering, all the watering is going to kill my energy. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Okay. Of course, I'm one short. <sighs> okay. Ah, oh, 61 energy. No, 59. But... How much time can I spend in the mine? Okay, reminder, it takes about an hour to walk this backwards way from the entrance of the mine to the house. Of course, the first floor I get to doesn't have but one slime. things first, let's get this amethyst. Now I'm at 30 energy. 
Is there a slime? Yes, there's a single slime. Out. Come on. Don't slow me. Did it. Now tomorrow I can talk to Lewis. Just need to focus on getting up and out of here. Leave the mine. It's getting late. Yeah. Okay. Don't get caught on the... Don't get caught on the scenery. Can't exactly call it foliage. It's not quite right. Okay, okay. In the house. In the bed. Sleep before 1 a.m. Okay. Foraging, level two. It is the first Queen of Sauce. This is a uh, stir fry, I think. Yeah, stir fry. Fortune teller, how good's today? Neutral. Weather tomorrow. Rain! Ah, oh, I was thinking about cutting the stream off after one week, but I gotta, I gotta try for upping my fishing and getting that rain. I'd like to apologize about joking about your grandpa's old cottage when we first met. It's a really a nice little house. However, you might need some more space someday. That's where I can help. If you're giving me some raw materials and pay a fee. I can expand your house. First expansion offer I offer includes a kitchen. With a kitchen, you'll be able to cook any recipe you've learned. Anyway, hope you're starting to feel at home in Stardew Valley. Your local carpenter, Bobbin. smelting going. Put those away. Uh, potato. Oops. Potato with me. pretty funny at this point there there have been three viewers in the chat for basically the whole stream and not a single message lurk lurk all you want but I just find it funny um, okay hang on Got slightly distracted there for a second. We've got parsnips to sell. The traveling cart is down there.
All right, that's that taken care of. Now let's sell these parsnips. Put the watering can away. Um, okay, hang on. Talk to Lewis. I did the four slimes I needed for that. Let's grab the fish that can be donated. Single clam. Rocks and wood. Um, okay. That's all the fish I have that can go into bundles. And I still got like half half of a day's energy. Um, I could go fishing today or I could go mining. I wanted to go fishing to get my fishing level up for when rain hits tomorrow. Plus, I can, while I'm in here, after I drop off the potato, um, spring potato, I can check the fish bundle, because I, I always forget what the ocean fish is that counts. Um, so, lake fish, you got. Three out of four sturgeons don't start until summer. Um, st sturgeons, I think, are summer and winter, specifically. Um, I could catch a bream, and, and eels are, are night in the ocean, breams are night in fresh water. Um, oh, sorry. Night raining ocean. Uh, right now, it's sunfish and catfish. I think you might be able to get sh shad also in the river when it's raining, but I, I can't remember for sure. Um, sunfish is specifically only sunny days, though. Uh, ocean, here we go. Sardine. Okay, sardine is the one to keep for the bundle. Because for some, some reason I get sardine and, uh... One of the other ocean fish mixed up. Alright. Alright, Goonts. We've got... Amethyst to donate. I came all the way out here and forgot to bring my fishing rod, but I'm gonna go down to the beach first in case there's wiggly worms and or things to, to salvage. No, no, no salvage. No wiggly worms, no salvage. Nothing. Okay. What's Pierce thing? Oh, someone wants ref refined quartz for Demetrius. Well, first of all, that would require me to go into the mine and find quartz in the first place. Oh, while you're here. Ah, Ninja! So you helped us with our slime problem. Thank you! Hope you didn't go through too much trouble. I know it can be really hard to get that sticky slime out of your clothes. 
I've definitely ruined a few good pairs of pants trying to catch those little wigglers. I can remember Papa going into a rage after I got glimmering gold slime all over my brand new silk pants. Well, anyway, enjoy your reward. Thank you for the 240. Okay. So, gotta go get my fishing rod. I wanted to see if Caroline's existing, to choosing to exist today. Oh, right, it's Sunday. She's hiding from the church crowd with Abigail. All right. that in there, put that in there, and then um, get my fishing rod out, uh, put away my, all of my other tools, We're just fishing. And we might even get some fish in time to sell them at, uh... Nice. Oh man, I've been pushing off my homework all week. Looks like I'll be pulling another all-nighter. Abigail. <sighs> Me too. Back in the days of school. Putting things off as long as possible. Hello, I hope your new farming life is panning out as you'd hoped. You know what? It is. This stream has been nice, relaxing, quiet, very quiet. <laughs> Uh, but good. Oh, so much for the perfect cast. I'll take Silver Star. Oh, already broke perfect cast. There's a sardine. Should have brought the spring onions. Perfect guest. Anchovy, that's the one I tend to mix up. Mm. 
messed up the perfect cast, but it's fine because there's treasure. It's extra fine because it was a regular quality anyway. Go ahead and get last two sails off. Ah. get out of Willy and fish next to him instead. This is either this one or the next one is the last cast. I'm not stopping on trash. Come on. Hook a fish. Just some more trash. Okay. I guess I am stopping on trash. Go donate this sardine. Hey, Clint. Go inside. Oh, I already got the trash. Nothing spawning on the beach. Okay, so tomorrow we go for a shad, a catfish, and then to the ocean for an eel. When it gets to be quote unquote nighttime. In the meanwhile, I'd say 700's pretty decent for either a bag or strawberry purchasing. I guess I'll have to decide next week how much money I want to go to the festival with to buy strawberries. 
You know, this was fishing, so there's the fishing chest. Um, put that in my inventory in case there's wiggly worms on the ground somewhere. Um, shouldn't need anything else. Alright. Fishing level 2. Didn't get fishing level 3, but... It's fine. Fishing level 2 is infinitely better than fishing level 0. When trying to catch the like eels and the catfish. Look, if I'm gonna get trash, at least I'm getting soggy newspaper. Because that has a chance of recycling into cloth. Am I gonna get a recycler anytime soon? Maybe, maybe not. But. Eventually, when I do. One of the easiest catfish I've ever gotten. Easily, I'll take it. Down, and it's gonna shoot back up. Didn't go actually nearly as far as I thought. Now I have a catfish that I could sell. Or I could store in case somebody says, Boy, could I use a catfish? Another smallmouth bass. Yep. Ah, now it's jumping around. Okay, this actually might be a catfish. I was thinking maybe this is the uh, the other fish. But it's jumping around enough that I'm thinking catfish. Yeah, there we are. Ah, good. A regular, regular quality catfish so I can just donate the basic quality and not have to donate silver. There it is, Shad. Oh, but it's Gold Star! Give me another one.
I don't want to donate a gold star, but I will if I have to. Just another catfish. I already caught three. already had one, so at least I didn't use another spot in my inventory. Treasure. Alright, now let's get this smallmouth bass. Oh, maybe it's not. No, it was. Uh, book and some rice. Oh, that's nice. It's the right season for rice. Go plant that. Okay, let's get the treasure. And now it's going to be something, now that I have one slot in my inventory, the treasure is going to be something that's like three things that I really want. Okay, just some coal. Monday. Before I accidentally do something that I'm going to regret. Let's just let's just go up here. River? Nope, wrong one. Catfish. Gold Star Shad. Sunfish on a sunny day. And we're gonna sell the rest of these fish, plant the rice, and then go down to the beach to go fishing for eel. Fifty wood, twenty fiber. Make a scarecrow. Ah, 
Neat. Exceeds. Okay. Help if I had access to it. Ox. Um... Didn't didn't think this through. Um, let's just do the mix seeds here. Um, and then grab the pickaxe and the axe. Aquawack. Uh, okay. Start with the pickaxe. X. Now let's till this soil right next to this. go. And we'll put Scarecrow there. Okay. It's five o'clock. Still got half my energy, roughly speaking. Let's go down to the beach, catch an eel, uh, if I, if I'm, if I'm quick on the eel catch, then maybe I'll come up and go for a bream in the river, though, I should probably try and catch a bream when it's not raining. Flounder? Herring. Okay. Come on, eel. That's that's the flounder. Yep, there we go. Come on, eel. Halibut. Caught it just for the halibut. Mm -hmm. 
Aha! There's the eel. Don't have much energy left for the day. So... Here I can donate this eel. Bream and sunfish are the last fish that I can catch for the fishing bundles in spring. As I recall. I mean, not counting specialty fish, obviously, because those caught in special places under special circumstances. But, uh, should be mostly in the clear on fishing. Well, Seed, chop down a tree. Forty five, okay. That's Pickaxe. Deal with a couple of these rocks. Can't deal with the big rock, but that's fine. All right. I think that is going to be. The last day, hang on, what's the living off the land say for today? Let's talk fences. Keeping weeds at bay, protecting your crops, containing livestock, break down after a while. The harder material fences last longer. Okay. Fishing level three. I can now craft crab pots for way too much materials and I got over 1000 G beautiful but I think that is going to be the stream I have enough gold now that I could buy backpack it is Tuesday, so I still have a few days before the uh, spring festival where I want to buy strawberries. But that's next week uh, problem. So uh, thank you guys for all being here. Uh, whoever the silent lurkers are. I appreciate you. And, uh, I will see you either on Thursday for the RPG stream or next week.